What's going on guys? So today I'm out here working on my Duramax, the LBZ, and I've been having some issues create building boosts and spooling up this new turbo that I put in. So I wanted to go ahead and test out uh, the whole entire boost system, make sure I don't have any leaks. Now what I got here is a little boost tester that I made from Home Depot. Uh, it's probably $5 in total. This is just an end cap, a two inch end cap. Uh, let's see if you can scroll in there yet yeah, two inch plug and then I got a valve stem from Walmart This is another two bucks for two of them You drill a 7 16 hole into the cap and then you pull your valve stem through and what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull off Your uh, hot side intercooler pipe. You're gonna throw in your tester there and then you're also gonna take your clamp like so throw it on here and then this is the cheapest way that I could possibly do it, but I'm just using air hose and an air chuck. And I set the regulator down really low on it. And then I'm also just using my manual gauge here to um, test it out and see how much I'm putting into it. I only ran it up to about mm, 15, 20 PSI. Um, and most of your leaks are gonna present themselves with at least that much pressure in them. I had a few small, little, little tiny hisses coming out around, you know, the top of this boot or top of this boot here. And I went and snugged them all up and it's holding 20 PSI without any leaks now. So, you know, it's a good, simple way to test out, um, you know, your boost system on your truck and make sure you don't have any dramatic leaks. I've even seen on the forums and guys having, you know, whole entire holes in their intercooler piping uh whole boots that got holes in them and you know they just don't know about them on a simple inspection until you actually pressurize it up and and hear it and it presents itself really easily so anyways i thought i'd show you guys this this is a five dollar duramax boost tester that you can you know buy and make same day if you're having issues with your truck and you want to check it out uh, let me know if you like this video in the comments below and I'll see you guys next time.